Tonight, dramatic video of a daring rescue by a Fairfax County firefighter. He rushed into a burning house, saved a dog who was trapped behind a gate in the basement. Fox 5's Paul Wagner joins us now with the very latest. Paul, incredible story. Hey, Sean, Ben Sisson is one of a small but growing number of firefighters who attach their helmets, um, I'm sorry, attach cameras to their helmets that are specially designed to withstand the heat, turning them on as they respond to all sorts of emergencies. The video capturing dramatic moments in a dangerous job. In his own words now, hear Ben Sisson as he narrates what happened on Carly Parkway last Sunday night. We got dispatched for the house fire. Um, as we were going down the road, our dispatch informed us that they started to receive multiple calls of a house on fire. Um, as we were going down the road, we could smell it in the neighborhood. So me and my officer, we grabbed our tools, went to the front door. Um, the door was locked, so nobody was home at the time, luckily, which we didn't know. I, I forced the front door open, and then we went inside. I mean, any firefighter would be lying if they told you they weren't scared, you know, because you don't, you don't know what you're walking into. You're walking into an, an unknown environment, you know. You don't know the layout of the house, and so you're going in blind. You can't see, you know, you're literally going by the feel of the wall. And somebody had told us that there were possibly dogs inside. So as soon as we went inside and we went downstairs, I started following the wall, and that's when I, I stepped on the dog's bed, and I reached down and I saw the dog. I saw the dog was laying there. I got a dog. That's when I informed my officer, I informed the lieutenant, I said, hey, I've got a dog here, I'm gonna go ahead and take the dog outside. Initially he laid down, but once it was once he got some fresh air, he started to start to come around a little bit. It allows you to go back and look at how you did and how you performed and how you can improve. I, there's not an incident that goes by that a firefighter shouldn't learn something. You know, I learned something from every call, every call I run. Now, the helmet cam is not an official piece of equipment for firefighters. It's a personal choice Fairfax Fire and Rescue allows its firefighters to make on their own. Sadly, only one of the three dogs rescued from the house that night survived. Still, Paul Wagner, Fox 5, local news. That's still incredible nonetheless, Paul. I mean, just to see the footage and just his wherewithal. And uh, a lot of more firefighters are wearing those cameras on their helmets, and, and they say they want to do that, Sean, so that they can uh, use them in training. Mm -hmm. And, uh, in fact, Ben told me that he goes back and looks at some of the emergencies that he responds to, and he says he learns every time he looks at the video. Yep, hindsight 2020, it's yeah. great if you can see it all, too. It sure Absolutely. is. Yeah. Thank, thank you, Paul. Sure.